everyone. Um, always autumn here. I'm Kat, obviously, if you've watched the videos. I just wanted to quickly sit down with you all and just apologise, really, for the lack of videos of late. I think the last one I uploaded was uh, probably on the 10th of April, um, with all the stuff of, like mine and James's two years anniversary. Um, but recently my head's just been an off on one, my mental health's been kind of shit. So, um, it got to the point the last couple of days where I just didn't want any human contact with anyone, not even James. So he was like, would just come and sort of bring some food into my flat and then just sort of leave me to it really. I'd still sort of like talk to him on Discord and stuff like that, but I just didn't want any like human contact and stuff. And I just really wasn't sort of doing anything, I was just sort of sleeping in. I mean, there was a time where I was literally awake for 36 hours just because I couldn't sleep. And that's not even exaggerating, I think it was 36 hours. So, yeah. Um, I'm feeling a little better now though, I'm feeling a little bit more motivated to sort of get things done. Um, and I have some bit of footage for when we went like shopping um, on the 12th and the 13th, but then after that I really just sort of, I don't know, I felt really drained I guess. Um, I was like sleeping until 3pm and staying awake until 3am kind of thing. Not even doing anything, I just couldn't sort of settle my brain down to actually sleep. And then when I did sleep I was just sort of, didn't want to get up again kind of thing. I just didn't want to move. And obviously when that's happening you just don't want to do anything, you don't want to you know, you don't want to vlog, there's nothing to vlog. So, yeah, it's kind of it really. Um, you know, I, I am getting help for it, it's just a slow process and my GP is really, really bad. It's really hard to sort of get in contact with them. And they basically said to me for them to do like anything, you know, refer you to a psychologist or anything like that, you basically have to try and kill yourself. For them to actually do anything about it otherwise it's all just pass you on from department to department you know i'm receiving counseling from my university but they're really busy so i'm not even getting an appointment very often um i'm trying to go through this other like counseling option sort of thing but it's really hard to make an appointment with them because i have no signal in this building so I can't really go outside and make a phone call because on this phone, like having my phone like here onto the ear, it just doesn't work. I have to have it on speakerphone, which, you know, I don't want to go outside and talk about my mental health and stuff in public, like try and make a phone call with them. Um, it's not, it's not great. So yeah, it's really hard to make an appointment with them. I've been trying to get an appointment via email, but they for some reason think that I'm trying to have the appointment via email when I'm not and you know they're just not it's not getting to them at all so trying to just do anything and I only really go home on the weekends to my mum's where I would have signal but then you know I don't really want to talk to about all that stuff when she's sort of there because she doesn't really get a lot of it um, like she's trying to be supportive and helpful but she just doesn't really sort of get to why I have problems kind of thing um, so it just feels awkward like to talk about it really but yeah so that's sort of where I've been literally just in this bed asleep or in the chair that I'm sitting in now on my laptop sort of just doing nothing really um, I just, you know, haven't been motivated to do anything, which just sucks, but the weather's getting nicer now and stuff, so I'm trying to maybe go out a little bit more, we can start to sort of travel more, so hopefully I can just do some more vloggy type things. Um, but I will say in advance, there might be days where there isn't a vlog or anything, because sometimes I just don't really do anything in the day and it's kind of boring just to watch like a five minute thing of me, I don't know, cleaning my flat or something. It's not not that exciting. Uh, so 
yeah it's not been great but I'm getting there and I'm trying to get some help and stuff um yeah that's it so just you know sorry again um so I have some as I said I have some footage from um previous days which I will put into this vlog that you're currently watching uh along <clears throat> pardon me along with today's vlog so today is the 17th of April um and this will all be uploaded on the 18th for you to all watch and hopefully it will have a more cheerier note than the beginning of it so I'll see you um after the other vlog footage hi everyone I uh kind of look like shit but I basically didn't sleep at all last night um I've just been sitting up on my laptop since like 5 6 a.m. just because I couldn't sleep and I just gave up in the end so <laughs> yeah um but anyways today is the 12th of April so that means that shops are now open in the in England um so I'm gonna brave the shops today and you know hopefully it <laughs> won't be very crowded it will be it will definitely be very crowded but I just want to go out and like you know look in the shops and just window shop and stuff so yeah um so it's currently 20 to 10 I've just been playing league really on my computer to the past time but I should go have a shower and make some food and put my makeup on to hide this you know horrible dark baggy eyes <laughs> and try and make the most of the day especially as it's sunny big portal of light there you go you can't see the rays on my hand <laughs> um so yeah that's the plan for today and hopefully i can just fuel myself with red bull because yeah <laughs> See you once I am all showered and ready. So we're out in town at the minute. Uh, it's been really fun, really sort of long experience. We've spent probably about two hours just in Debenhams, <laughs> but that's because they were having a huge sale. So we're just gonna show everyone that later. But we're going to continue continue on our adventure. Yeah. Yeah. Done with the day, we just need to walk home. But we've got bubble tea. Yeah. Excuse the uh, washing machine in the background, it's doing drying things. Uh, but we're back from the adventure to the shops. It was a good day. We got a lot of like good deals as well. Um, and things which, you know, it was it was a good day, wasn't it? Not, it was, yeah. Not so long. <laughs> nods along in the background uh we have had sort of like a treat day so we got some german doner kebab for dinner and we're just waiting on our desserts which will be very nice and then probably just gonna chill and play some games for the evening mm -hmm. um and i'm gonna try and fix my sleep schedule because i've been awake for a very very long time now I can't even think of how long I've been awake, <laughs> over 24 hours, and I'm still running really, really like, like I'm on speed. <laughs> Can't uh, confirm. <laughs> uh, yeah, my makeup's gone a bit thingy now. Um, so yeah, uh, we didn't, we vlogged a little bit outside, but I may have forgot to do like time lapses and stuff. Uh, just because I suck. Well, no, because <laughs> we because of you know, just busy going to the shops. It was very busy in town anyway, so sort of avoiding people because people just don't know what social distancing means. Um, and because I don't wear a face mask, 
um because i can't wear it because i can't wear a face mask i feel like i need to avoid people a bit more and it's just awkward um but yeah need to go into town again tomorrow because james got me a very very nice jacket but they didn't take the security tag off of it. I don't know how we got out of the shop with it on. But yeah. And it's one of those ones that is like the inky one. So I can't take it off. Which is annoying. But hopefully we can go into Primark as well. Because I want to do like a DIY project with some of the um, cheap t-shirts. Yeah. Any But anyway. Hopefully dessert will be here in about 10 minutes or so. Yeah. Morning everyone. Um, I didn't end last night's vlog, so I'm gonna roll it into with today's vlog. And oh, let me put it out for well for the day that you'll watch this, um, which for me is tomorrow. I am gonna grab my shower and get myself ready. Um, because I need to go back up to Debenhams because I got this really nice leather jacket. Looks really, really nice, except they forgot to take the security tag off and it's one of these ones that are ink. Got like the ink in it. So, yeah, I need to go get that removed. Obviously I've got the receipt for it and stuff, so hopefully they'll be alright with that. Um, so yeah, that's sort of what I'm going to wear today, um, with my new, one of the new skirts that I got, and, um, I'll show you it when I'm all dressed and got my makeup on and stuff, but I need to go quickly have a shower, because it's, uh, already half two, and, um, yeah, I think shops close at, like, five, <laughs> so better be speedy. So... So we went out to the shops, I got the security um, tag taken off the um, jacket and I'm wearing some of my new clothes today, I've got like this nice dress skirt on and stuff. Um, but so I'm in, a, I'm in voice chat still so <laughs> they're just chatting shit. But um, yeah, I just we didn't stay out for too long, we got another bubble tea because... Uh, may have an addiction to that um yeah base we didn't stay out too long i wanted to go into primark but the queue is just fucking really really long at the moment um so i'll have to wait found a nice suitcase that i can uh, buy for my travels when i have a little bit more money in and yeah i'm gonna um gonna <clears throat> go do dinner soon even though it's ten past nine in the evening and yeah i'm literally just playing some games and stuff uh which is pretty much just uh, how my life goes yeah My camera's wonky. There we go. Today uh, I am heading over to my mum's to do some more chores around the house and stuff for her. So I need to pack my bag. Let's get on with that. home um at my mum's house we just watched the funeral of um prince philip duke of edinburgh um it was very respectful very you know it was done really well um and my greatest respect and sympathies go out to the queen and to all of her family 
but now I am going to go finish painting Poppy, my rabbit's little cottage that I did a few days, a few weeks ago, because there's a bit, a few little sort of touch-ups I need to do on there. Um, and then I have to paint the bathroom door, the final bits of the bathroom door, um, and do like the sand it all down, do the undercoat and stuff, and then do the gloss probably do the gloss tomorrow seeing i don't know how fast it will dry it's quite warm so maybe do the gloss today um and yeah that's sort of the plan for the next couple of hours and see how it goes from there <laughs> first coat of paint on um, the bathroom door. I also did the door under the stairs and a little part of the um, stairs that I kind of missed a bit when we did it before. Um, but I've had, that's, still, that's still drying. It's drying really slowly even though it's quite warm today. Um, I didn't film any footage really of me painting mainly because my phone was going to die. <laughs> Um, and you know, it's not the most exciting content, but we've had dinner and we've watched two more episodes of The Crown and now I am going to just hang out on my laptop for a little bit and then probably go, either go to bed or go back downstairs. So, yeah. Right, I'm off to bed now. Um, I played some League a bit with James and then hung out with, um, I'm a little more and stuff, played with the rabbit and the cat, but now I am off to bed, so see you all tomorrow. Bye.